Hello. In my previous video, I explained how to attach notes and how to put notes in a task and how to attach files. So for the task one, I attached a link and I attached a file. Now let me show you where are those files saved. To do that, I can go here, okay, three dots, and team files. Remember, first of all, that I have group assigned to this project, which is called block project for the web, okay? And I, if I go now to teams files, team files, I will see that I have SharePoint site, which was created when the group was created. And here, you can see here, okay, that I have this file, PMI, PMP, PDF, and here in the SharePoint file, you can find it here. So this SharePoint file is uh, connected to my group. So what can I do? I can add here, upload, okay, some other file. Let's say that I have a PMI ACP and I have certificate. Here it is, okay, ACP. Now, see what, what will happen if I go to, let's say, task number two. If I go to task number two and I want to attach a file, I can attach file from computer or from Teams file. And if I open Teams file, I will get the exact same structure because this, this attachment from Teams file goes directly to the SharePoint. And now I can say, okay, PMI ACP, save. And now I will have PMI ACP from my SharePoint site, which is assigned to the group. Okay, that was the easy part. Now let me show you one thing more. Let's say that we have specific documents, which are PMI PMP PDF and PMI ACP PDF, which belongs to this project. Now let me open another project. I will say new blank project and I will say another project. Okay, I will say that this is, let's say, uh, September and this will go to 27th of September, great. And I will now here go and say task A. Okay, I don't want to bother with duration, etc., etc. And I will say that group members are from the same group like my previous project, block project for the web. So I want to use same resources which are in a group project for the web. Blo oh, sorry, blog project for the web. Now I'm going to attach file here, an attachment from computer, from computer. And I will say that I want to here put my diploma. Let's say I will attach my diploma here. And as you can see, here it is. Okay, but let's go back to my team's team files. As you can see, diploma is here. What I want to say is, and what I want to explain here, is if you have more than one project which is attached to the same group, so another project is uh, uh, attached or connected to the group called Block Project for the Web, 
and my this is my pro, uh, this is project which my name is also attached or uh, uh, connected to the same group they will share files so what does it mean if i want to see files from a specific project in my sharepoint side which belong to my group i will not be able to uh uh, uh be uh, uh, to recognize which file belong to which project okay for that purpose you can add new let's say folder just and say okay i have this is the project with a name okay i will copy it and i should move those files to specific folder because if i don't do that i will have all my files in one same directory in one uh, let's say sharepoint site i will not use directory i'm not a sharepoint expert as you can notice but this is teams files this is my group and you should be aware that all files are placed in the same place so you cannot know to which project which file belongs not even that but now i can go to as you can see i have two two attachments pmi pmp and i have pmi acp and if i want add attachment i can do a uh, add attachment from uh team files and i can here see my diploma so i can use the same document which was used in other project or another project which is diploma okay open details here as well in my second project so what i want to say if you use one group for multiple projects and you put all the files in the same team files team the, uh, team sharepoint site you will not be able to make a difference between documents which document belongs to which project but you will be able to use all files from here to all projects which belongs to the group called sorry called in my case project for the web hope this helps thank you very much and have a nice day